Hey, what's going on people? This is Ian Ward. Thankful to be alive on this beautiful Saturday morning in February. Now today I'm going to show you around part of downtown Fairfield. And the reason why is because it's kind of warm today and it's also pretty sunny. But also note that I did not bring my Osmo Mobile with me because, you know, the, where I was earlier, I couldn't really bring it. So, yeah, so sorry about it. The quality may not be as good as other videos. But, you know, if you want me to do a second tour around Fairfield, which I most likely will do, I will definitely bring my Osmo Mobile with me. So, anyhow, so let's get started. So, today, this is the Old Post Tavern restaurant. Now, this has been around for like eight or nine years, I want to say. And this place serves American food, seafood, steak, you name it. Just a little quick look at the menu right there. So yeah, so anyhow, so Fairfield was incorporated in 1639, and yeah, it's been functioning ever since. It's been through all of the wars, really, including the Revolutionary War. But yeah, here's a local barber, in case you want to get a snippy haircut. All right, here's a little local glasses shop. All right, and as you can see right here, there is the local gazebo where I shot my first video of February again sorry if that was a bit late but again then again I posted two videos in a day again what I realized about my goal getting a little off topic here but about the goal for posting a video every day as long as I post 365 videos you know I think that should be good people right all right so anyhow so here's another neat place called be good which for some of you who may or may not know this place this is a place where they serve burgers, smoothies, salads, but they're all from the local New England area. And even New York, so yeah, these are definitely fresh ingredients. Also, there's the Firehouse Deli right back there. In fact, the Firehouse Deli used to be the old Fairfield Firehouse back a long time ago, but they turned it into a deli. And so it's a popular spot, especially in the spring and summer. All right, so... Yeah, if you notice, a lot of these buildings around here are made out of brick. Yeah, this is from way back in the day. These old brick buildings. Yeah. And then, if you can see down there, I'm not sure if you can see it, but there is the local university bookstore. Uh, we can go into that in, later in a different tour. But yeah, so anyhow, here's the Fairfield Center Jewelers. This is a place that's been around for as long as I can remember, at least. All right. Oh yeah, anyhow, people, so. And there's the local bus line going through. Alright, so for those of you who may be on the West Coast or who've been in New York City a lot, there is Pinkberry. Yeah, this has been around for at least seven years. And here is another popular spot in town, Colony Grill, which is a local pizza place that serves thin sliced pizza. Like when I mean thin, I mean really thin places. Like come here on a Friday or Saturday night and this place will be swamped. All right, people, so that's what I think I'm going to show you for today for right now. Again, if you want me to do a full tour of downtown Fairfield, let me know in the comments below. Tell again, this is Ian Ward signing off. Thanks for being alive. I'll see you people tomorrow. Bye.